Hey people, welcome to the Whole Tip Daily. As American, I can appreciate the value of a good old-fashioned strip club. Sometimes you gotta lighten up and enjoy the party, you know? Besides, there's a whole sense of tradition when you get down to it. What can I say? I'm a sucker for American culture. Even if you cannot be convinced that strip clubs are any good, can we at least agree that it's none of the government's damn business? Or is that just my freedom kink showing? Like, come on, they're not bothering anybody. So, I was surprised to read that Scotland's capital banned strip clubs entirely. I don't know how the entire thing works in Scotland, but a band like this seems a little authoritarian to me. What do I always say? Sure, we're looking at good versus evil lately, but also, more obviously, it's cool people versus fun suckers. Edinburgh lap dancers slam strip club ban bid over fears of greater risk of harm. Labour and Tory members united to vote for the blanket ban after hearing from activists who said clubs promoted the sexual objectification of and violence towards women. Women? Oh my god, you mega Karen cuntasauruses. Yes, strip clubs objectify women. The women that choose to be there and are also handsomely compensated for it. That's showbiz, baby. If we're going to talk about objectifying women, if you're so concerned about that, maybe the focus should be on, but that's a whole nother can of worms I'm not gonna crack open today. Plus, they're seriously just making shit up to push their agenda of making the world a more dull, lifeless place. How in the hell, exactly, do strip clubs promote violence towards women. If going to Titty City makes you want to start being a violent dick to the ladies, that's a personal problem. You're fucked in the head. Luckily, those sickos are a minority among us, so there's no reason to ban strip clubs over it. If your end goal was really to protect women from violence, wouldn't the focus be on locking violent criminals up and keeping them that way? Sorry, Scotland, I'm not totally sure how that's going for you guys over there, but over here, it's a real shit show. And look, now these girls have to go out and get real jobs. She doesn't even like working at a bar, you monsters. According to the strippers, they don't want a real job so bad that they will be willing to put themselves in danger. And it's all your fault, Scotland government. Am I the only one thinking? You could just move to a different city? Is there a flaw in my argument here or something? Whatever. Teach their own. Well, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like, share, and subscribe.